Hello everyone, Gucci for the win here. Welcome back to our Dragon Ball Z team training Nuzlocke. I feel like we start every episode in a Pokemon Center or Healing Center or whatever you want to call it. Uh, but that's it's also where we end up ending pretty much all of our episodes. Uh, so we have more of the same today, except um, we don't have something like a concrete thing that we can actually go do um, like we did yesterday. Yesterday we were able to finish the... Oh, excuse me, the little fighting dojo um, that's in Satan City. Uh, we were able to do that um, and get Spopovich, who is in the box. Uh, we've got enough dark types on the team, so I didn't see f I didn't see the reason for adding another one. Um, so that's why he's not on the team. But um, we're we are we are very close to evolving this Go Tanks. Very super close. So our goal for today is to evolve Go Tanks and hopefully start to level up Garlic a little bit. Um, and whatever. So, as long as we evolve Gotenks today, whatever level Garlic is at, at the end of this episode, is the level he will be when we go to take on this next gym. And that's what, that's just, that's it. That's what we're going to do. That's how we're going to do it. Okay, I did learn... At the end of the last episode, we are high enough level to one-shot these guys with an energy ball. Um, now, for future references, if you guys would just prefer me do all of this in a grinding montage, please let me know. Or if you, if you like this to be part of the experience, then fine. That works too. Uh, just let me know. Yes. <laughs> it's all, it's just the best. Just going back and fighting the same four dudes over and over. I, th I think the best dude didn't even want to fight me either. Like, the best guy to fight in all of this is, uh, the stupid, um, Yeah, that dude right there, the middle one, on the left, because he's got the two inner 14s, and they give, like, almost 600 experience apiece, which is super spicy. How close are we to one-shotting you with an energy ball? Very. Probably another level, and we could do it. Well, I'm hoping another level evolves, go tanks. That would be very helpful. <laughs> immensely, immensely helpful. No go tanks. Thank you, go tanks. So we also learned in the last episode. Gotenks has hustle. <laughs> so, uh, exhibit, well, example, right there. Um, Ghost Kamikaze attack has 100% accuracy, uh, but because we have hustle, it can miss. Oh, man. Which I just love. But that's what that's what happens when you trade accuracy for power. Is it a good trade? I don't know. Could not tell you. I really don't think we level up. Come on, please. Sheesh, and you crit me, man. Go tanks, please stop doing this. Thank you. 
Sheesh. Dash attack. Now, uh, Gotenx is pretty bulky, so he, he can tank a lot of hits. I prefer him not to. I'd prefer to keep him as healthy as a horse. If at all possible, but they don't really leave me a choice most of the time. You know, we've probably... How much money do we... <laughs> do we have? We have $54,000 right now. Um, so we can actually buy some items. If we wanted to. There we go, level 38. Please evolve. Four health, holy crap. Yes! Yes! Thank goodness. Whew. Took forever. Look at that. Look at that powerful hair on him. Trying to learn Key Bomber. Um, it is stronger than Energy Ball, so yes. Awesome. Alright, so that means now... We can put Garlic in front. And let him take over some of the fighting duties now. Hopefully he does not take as long to level up as Gotenks. Um, uh, I'm also hoping that um, Garlic is strong enough to take these guys out fairly quickly over here. Um, so there is a combo I can kind of do, but it's it takes two turns to do it, and I don't know if I necessarily necessarily want to do it. But we'll see what happens. How much does a headbutt do? It's gonna do more than half. Oh, so close. So close. I hope we I hope we just got low rolled. <laughs> That's what I hope. But I don't think that's the case. Wild Slash. Another Bear Thief. No, we actually high rolled on that first one. Oh, this one has better defense one of those two things is correct <laughs> one of those two statements is correct all right we're gonna spell him uh yeah we'll keep blasting There we go. I was a little worried that that was a, a little bit over ambitious. <laughs> it probably was, uh, but I didn't get punished for it. 
which is the dangerous part about it all. Okay. So we got some more bear thieves over here. These will definitely take two headbutts. That will do nothing. Thankfully. But this will level up garlic, which is good. I mean, our attack is much stronger than anything. But we don't have a lot of physical moves. Which is kind of dumb. You know what I mean? Napa. We're actually running out of headbutts already? That's crazy. That is super crazy. Alright, this one's gonna be more key blasts anyways. So it's alright. Uh, just don't use Dizzy Punch. That, that'd be great. If you could refrain... Yes, thank you. Appreciate it. Alright, so this is one I'm gonna have to do the spell key blast. Uh, shindig on. Just a guarantee. No, that's not good. Fifty eight to twenty nine. That is exactly half. Um, I could not risk uh, this key blast not one shotting. From a minus two. That was a crit, so that does not help us to know whether or not it will. One shot in the future. <laughs> so, thanks. Thanks a lot. Alright, so we got Raditz and Raccoon. Uh, we're gonna let the Vegeta take the Raccoon. Um, because the less exposure Raditz has to... Or, not Raditz. The less exposure... Um, garlic has to these fighting types, the better. Which is why most of these trainers are okay to fight. Because a lot of them don't have fighting types. Which is really helpful. I, I looked up a bunch of stuff today just to kind of see where we were at um, and like if if I was actually taking on the correct gym I need like which gym I should be working on um, I should have looked up when Vegeta gets his next move I also got to look at some of the cool cool things that happen in like post game so I'm excited for that Post game is gonna be fun. Uh, 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 uh. I just want to get there. I gotta get there first. That that is 
Goal number one. Make it to post game. Everyone wants to fight again. That is good. That is good for the experience. Alright, we can probably spell key blast you. Save some headbutts. Uh, that way we can one-shot the bear thieves on the other guy. Which would be nice. It would be super nice to one-shot those guys. It would be nice when we're able to one-shot you. With a grand old, uh, key blast or whatever. Or headbutt. I do like that they're not taking my item. <laughs> that, that is very that is very nice for them not to do that. Really, man. Hey, we got the flinch. Good. Good, 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 good. We got the flinch. Garlic goes to level 34. We do know for a fact that garlic does not evolve any further. So anything from here on out is strictly for stats and potential new moves. So we should be able to one-shot these uh, bear thieves with a headbutt now, which is good. Takes them out quick, gets, gets us on to the next one faster, which is a lot better. Getting close to one-shotting you, which is good. Just try to get through this. Oh, are you kidding me? Sheesh, man. You kill me. You you literally kill me. Gosh. Okay. Dodoria. Alright, this was one we could spell key blast. Before we go into the next fight, I want to use a Satan drink. Because these dudes do carry Dizzy Punch, which is not fun. Uh, but we can two shot them um, with the Energy Blast. Or key blast, whatever it's called. Or we should be able to. We were able to two shot him before. With uh, it was it looked close, but now it seems we can do it with relative ease, which is really good. It's it's what you hope for, you know. It's what you hope for. That's a crit. That's not very nice, man. Why you gotta be like this? Alright. So hopefully Raditz doesn't have anything too crazy for us today. That, is, that would be very preferable, my man. If you just didn't have anything. Like, if you want to flinch, that'd be great. <laughs> you 
If someone wants to mail me a million dollars, that'd be great. Tremendously. You've gotta be kidding me. You've gotta be kidding me. gotta bring some fodder here so we're gonna put all these guys on the team at the moment there our party's full <sighs> I am so freaking angry at myself uh, did I ever teach that bear? I did. Okay, that's good. That's good to know. It's very good to know. I can buy 52 of them. They will only need 15. <sighs> Well, you know what they say. There's nothing to it but to do it. Uh, let's check Gotenks' ability. Does he still? He, yep, he still has hustle. Great. Wonderful. Okay. Well, let's go take on Bobbity. Um, let's see what's what's the fastest way. Okay, I'm just I'm just going in diagonals now. Diagonal me. Yeah, this will get me there. Eventually. There we go. All right, let's get this over with. Pui pui. Flash attack. My heart is racing already. already racing <laughs> yak on just put Vegeta out there wow one shot from a punch that's really good 
Uh, the Bora. I think I'm okay with punching you. Wow, Vegeta! Holy crap, are you strong? I love you. comes down to. That's really strong. Yes! Go take the monster! Yes! Oh my god. Gotenks is a monster. He's a monster, I tell you. I'm so happy. I am so pleased. Beyond measure right now. Gotenks was so worth the time and effort. Without a doubt. Without a doubt. Worth every single minute invested into him. Worth it. Worth it. Absolutely. <sighs> All right. Um. Well. <sighs> Let's keep Spopovich and Bear Thief for right now. Um, because there's a couple things I want to do. First of all, I want to go up here on this ledge because there's a couple. There's some trainers up here. I don't know if I fought them, and I want to make sure I do that. Before we move on. Teen Gohan. Using Mach Punch, thank you. Super Saiyan Teen Gohan. Get out here, Bear Thief. Bring in Majin Vegeta. He's gonna energy punch me. And now he's gonna mock punch me. Great. Thank you. Thank you! Thank you! There we go, level 41. Thank you, thank you. The speed, oh my gosh, the lightning speed. I'm really surprised Beard Thief did not level up. If I'm being honest. All right, we're gonna do this double battle. Yamu and Spokovich. Oh, 
Of course you'd miss. Why would you not? Oh, and of course you're gonna double kick and crit into that slot. And you're gonna body slam into it. There we go. Oh, man. Alright, I know I'm excited, but I cannot get too comfortable. I cannot. Aw, oh, come on. Is there anything up there, even? I mean, I'm sure there's an item. Let's let's go to West City first because I want to talk to that dude. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure he's the one that gives you the turtle suit. If he doesn't, then it's in the uh, the Bobbity Zone, which means we're gonna have to take another trip up there. I don't think that's the case though. Like I think it's I think it's this dude over here. I was wrong. So it's gotta be in the Bobbity Zone then. Awesome. It's not awesome. Switch train the bear thief. You might be asking, why are you switch training the bear thief? Because I want to. Realistically, Bear Thief um, is actually kind of strong, like, in a weird kind of way. Like, he's got some pretty good power to him. He's kind of like a glass cannon, though. And we need more fighters actually on the team, so figured why not. Does this one shot nerd? Oh, it does. It was a crit. I don't think that was necessary. But I'll take it anyways. Uh, plus one thing we can do with Bear Thief, we can awaken him at the Guru. Which uh, is something we'll have to do in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode. Subscribe if you're not already. Um, Tomorrow we're going to take a visit up to Guru, um, and we'll probably have to go back into the Bobbity Zone to get the turtle suit, or wherever it is. It might not even be there. I'm going to look it up. So, uh, but thanks again. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.